I'm making this video for those who want to transform your body. Whether you want to lose weight, gain weight, get rid of a chronic disease and just simply create a body that is beautiful, even an aesthetic body, let me tell you that it's not possible if you focus on the body. Your focus has to be on what you want to do and then the body adapts its form to do that thing. And this is the secret that nobody in the fitness industry is going to tell you. Hi, my name is Guru Pashupati and uh, I'm a, a yogi from the Himalayas. I've stayed there for many years and uh, I've done some incredible things with my body. I've transformed my body many, many times over and over and I've helped my students do the same and this video will help you to do the same too. If you look at scientific research, you can find something and its opposite is also true all the time, isn't it? You can find research that coffee is good for you. You can also find research that coffee is bad for you. So let's understand that it's not internal, it's not external circumstances that decide what happens to the body, but it's the internal circumstances. In the mountains, we used to sit naked in the snow and melt the snow around us with the heat coming from our body. And we had the motivation to do that. We needed to awaken the energy in the body called Kundalini. And we needed, uh, we were really creating a body that can do that. All right. So the whole goal of our life is reflected in our body. Whatever your body wants to do, it takes that form. Look at the form your body has now come to. It's because you haven't been directing it. It's just like a car with no driver randomly crashing into things because it has to move and nobody is there to drive it, direct it towards a goal. So it goes into the gutter, its wheel gets stuck, it hits this, it hits that. That's what's happening with our body. It's recreating itself based on a purpose and when it doesn't find purpose, it creates all sorts of things including cancer in your body. So if you want to reverse it, you want to reverse chronic kidney disease, you want to reverse cancer, you want to reverse liver problems, whatever it is, however serious it is, it happens with one question. What is the big problem that I want to solve in the world? It cannot be a personal problem. It has to be a large problem that you want to solve. And the moment you decide to solve that large problem, your body starts taking the shape to solve that problem. Okay. And this has to come from your heart. You have to really feel it. We are here as human beings. We're problem solvers. Each one of us is a problem solver. Do you know that? All of us are here to solve problems. Nobody came here to have problems because there are enough problems already and we need to solve it. The earth itself gives us a gift of problems that we need to solve. And so we create our own problems too. In trying to solve those problems, we create our own problems too. So it's something we need to set ourselves to that we have to do. I'm not saying that uh, diet and exercise and other stuff is, is not important. They're all important, but the percentage of how important it is, is not more than 20%. 80% of it is your purpose. When your body, when your mind says, this is what I want to do, I really sincerely want to do this. Your body starts taking that form, you know. So when I said that I want to teach martial arts, my body started taking the form of a martial artist. A few years ago, I was sick because all I wanted to do was, was nothing. <laughs> I had no ambition. So my body started withering away. The moment I got ambition, I reversed type 1.5 diabetes and then things started. So I attributed it initially to various things that I was doing. And finally, I realized that what changed in me was of course all the external stuff. You'll do all the external stuff when internally you have something to prepare your body for. And the body is very intelligent. It knows how to change itself. It knows how to face almost anything in this world. If you just give it a chance, it takes a few days and it starts recovering. Okay, so ask yourself this question. The most important question is, what do I want to do? Which problem do I want to solve in the world? Which problem do I want to solve in the world? Ask yourself, feel the question in your body and stay in your body. Don't float outside. 
I've made many videos on staying in your body and its importance. So don't check out as soon as you close your eyes, don't go out of your, your body somewhere. Sit and feel the body sensation and say, what problem do I want to solve in the world? And every negative sensation in your body will dissolve and you will be replaced. Your, you'll, your cells will be replaced with new cells, renewed cells, renewed for the purpose. All right. I hope you found this video useful. This is really the ultimate knowledge that you need to make the body of your dreams. Don't dream of your body. Your body takes the shape of your dreams. Dream of something else. Dream of something big. And the body will take the shape to fulfill that dream. All right. So thank you very much for watching. If you found this video useful, hit share. A lot of people need to hear this info. And uh, subscribe to my channel, leave a comment and tell me what you learned. And uh, I will see you in my next video.